the distribution of marks obtained by 60 student is on mac examination is as follow find coefficient of skewness by Carl Pearson method and state the types of skewness first check with the observation and then number of students in the number of students the frequency you can see it has been repeated so here we have median wala formula use karenge as we are finding Carl Pearson method so first take all the information in the book here you can see the class and the frequency I took as it is a continuous frequency distribution I already find out mid value now after getting mid value we'll continue with the multiplication of this to find out fx that is 5 5 are 25 12 into 15 180 and like this continue in your calculator use your calculator while going through this simply directly don't copy otherwise you won't get the practice of this so just take the total here and now we'll find out first mean that is sigma fx upon n and the value 3770 divided by 120 you will get 31.42 again we got the answer in decimal so the next column what we find out is fx square for the standard deviation where this two column will multiply 5 into 125 oh sorry 5 into 25 125 15 into 180 will be 2700 the next 23750 four zero five zero zero two one one seven five and the total is one three four eight zero zero now next what we find out is median first let's find out the median for this we need cumulative frequency where we we'll take the five first from the frequency five plus twelve seventeen plus 38 55 plus 38 93 plus 20 113 plus uh, 20 uh, plus 7 that is 120 so here we get the cf as well now let's find out the median qk a continuous frequency distribution hai bada wala formula use karenge to jab value dhoon rahe just take n upon 2 don't take plus 1 remember this observation so here we get 120 upon 2 observation that is 60th observation so 60 will come in 93 sorry yeah by mistake so here we get the lower limit then this is the frequency and the cf will be 55 Let's take all the information for median L plus N upon 2 minus CF upon frequency into C. The lower limit we found is 30 plus N upon 2, 60. CF we find out 55 and the frequency was 38 into the class length 30 minus 40, 10. The subtraction of this that is 5 upon 38 into 10. The 5 into 10 will be 50 upon 38. 30 plus the division of this 1.32 and the final answer 31.32. That's what the median we found. Next standard deviation. Sigma fx square upon n minus. Now let's keep the value. Sigma fx square that is 1, 3, 4, 8, double 0 n is 120 minus 3770 divided by 120 whole square now get them divide here you will get the answer 1123.33 minus the division of this 9 it would be 31.42 whole square 1123.33 31.42 multiplied by 31.42 you will get 987.22 get them subtract 136.11 and the square weight root of it you will get 11.67 so here all the values are ready 
mean then median and standard deviation so here we'll find out coefficient of skewness that is 3 mean minus median upon standard deviation now we'll keep the value 31.42 for median uh, sorry mean median is 31.32 standard deviation is 11.67 that is 3 0 0.1 divided by 11.67 the multiplication of this 0 0.3 11.67 and here we get the answer 0 0.026 next question number four the frequency distribution of profit earned by 150 companies during the year 2015-16 is as follow find the coefficient of skewness using appropriate method and state the types of skewness now here we can see the less than 10 10 to 20 20 to 30 30 to 40 and 40 and above even we can see the frequency is given now appropriate method yani ki ab aapki choice hai ki aap carl pearson method se use kar, find out karna chahte hain ya bowley's method se here i am choosing bowley's method by, because here i only have to find out cf bowley's method mein hame q3 q1 median itna hi dhoonna hai to hame to sirf chahiye cumulative frequency for this so just take the cumulative frequency by adding the frequency 15 15 plus 30 45 plus 50 that is 95 plus 40 135 and plus 15 150 so here my information is ready and is it as it you can see a continuous frequency distribution hai to bada wala formula use karenge sabse pehle q1 mein value of n upon fourth observation dhundle that is 150 upon fourth observation so here I get 37.5 observation now we'll check ki 37.5 kaun se number mein aega cf mein 45 mein aega drag the line that's my lower limit, that's my frequency, and that would be my cumulative frequency. Now we'll keep the formula L plus N upon 4 minus CF upon frequency into C. The lower limit is 10. N upon 4 is 37.5. CF 15, frequency 30. Class length 10 minus 20, 10. Now we'll get them subtract here we'll get 22.5 upon 30 into 10 10 plus get them multiply you will get 225 divide by 30 that is 10 plus 7.5 and the answer is 7.5 here we are ready with q1 next q3 that is the value of 3 and upon 4th observation. And have 150 divided by 4th observation. 3 multiplied by 37.5th observation. And here we get the Q3 is 112.5 fifth observation again cf mein ja ke dekhte 112 to 95 to kam hai ye wala cf will select where we get the lower boundary point frequency and cf now we'll keep into the formula so here we get 30 plus the subtraction of this two you will get 117.5 divided by 40 into 10 the multiplication of this you will get 175 divided by 40 30 plus get them divide you will get 4.375 and if you add them 34.375 which will be 
क्योंकि थर्ड डिजिट आपका फाइव है आगे बढ़ जाएगा तो Q1 वन एंड क्यू थ्री इज रेडी नेक्स्ट वी नीड इज मीडियन नाम फॉर मीडियन एंड अपॉन टू रिमेंबर वन फिफ्टी डिवाइड बाई टू दैट इज सेवेंटी फाइव ऑब्जर्वेशन सेवेंटी फाइव विच विल कम इन दिस नाइन्टी फाइव लोअर लिमिट ट्वेंटी फ्रीक्वेंसी फिफ्टी एंड क्यूमलेटिव फ्रीक्वेंसी फोर्टी फाइव द वैल्यू इन द मीडियम फॉर्मूला एंड थर्टी अपॉन फिफ्टी इन टू टेन दैट्स कम ट्वेंटी प्लस थ्री हंड्रेड डिवाइड बाई फिफ्टी गेट दैम डिवाइड यू विल गेट सिक्स एंड द आंसर इज ट्वेंटी सिक्स सो ही वी गेट द वैल्यू ऑफ मीडियम क्यू वन एंड क्यू थ्री नाउ द फाइनल विल फाइंड आउट दिस इज द फॉर्मूला ऑफ कोफिशन ऑफ स्क्यूनेस इन द बाउलीज मैटर एंड हेयर आई गेट द वैल्यूज नाउ जस्ट गेट दैम एड यू विल गेट फाइव वन पॉइंट एटी एट माइनस द मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ दिस टू विल बी फिफ्टी टू एंड द सब्सट्रैक्शन ऑफ दिस सिक्सटीन पॉइंट एटी एट नाउ गेट दैम सब्सट्रैक्ट यू विल गेट फिफ्टी टू बड़ा है तो पीछे आंसर माइनस में आएगा यू विल गेट सिक्सटीन पॉइंट एटी एट एंड द आंसर इज माइनस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो वन एक्चुअली द आंसर इज माइनस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो जीरो सेवन वन तो सेवन है पाँच से ज़्यादा है तो आगे वाला नंबर बढ़ गया बाई जीरो से वन मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन